As I'm standing here in downtown Rochester, it is quite dreary and cold. Now the kids are on spring break this week, but maybe a month ago would have been a better time. On March 2nd, the high temperature hit 64 degrees and was the first of several record-breaking days in the month. The first half of March was consistently above normal, with high temperatures mainly in the 50s and 60s, and on the 11th, 74 degrees was recorded in Rochester. In Mason City, the mercury soared to 76 degrees on both the 3rd and the 11th of March. While the first half of the month was warm and dry, the second half of March was the complete opposite. A powerful early spring snowstorm brought over 6 inches of snow to Rochester in southern Minnesota, and everyone received some beneficial moisture with up to two inches of rain falling in North Iowa. Now this one storm was impactful in several ways. March ended up with more than average rainfall and average snowfall. Not only that, but the warm start to the month led to ideal soil conditions, allowing for all the moisture from the storm to soak into the ground, improving drought conditions. It may not look like it right now, but before we know it, spring will be back and the sun and warmer temperatures will be here to stay. In Rochester, meteorologist Travis Clark-Smith, KIMT News 3.